Hey guys, Adrian Fertile here and today I decided to finally announce that I'm going to reveal some of my ideas for the Dark Railway series mainly focusing on three events The first one happens in 1989 which is one of my favourites Steam on the Met which celebrates 100 years of the Metropolitan being re... well, it w happened to be opened and what they've done is they had a number of engines like a uh, Black 5, Standard Class 4 and quite possibly the K1 I think which is number 6 to the row 5 so my idea for that is have Dave and Hannah from the Dark Quarry starring in that uh, well Steam on the Met Gala in 1989 my second idea is a rail tour that Blue Peter was involved which I believe was in April or May of 1994 where unfortunately she did part of on Durham and as she came off the bridge she had a massive wheel slip which was equivalent to 140 miles an hour which is a record that no steam lover would want to claim and unfortunately shredded her motion likely uh, her wheels are a little bit knackered and connecting rods bent so that means that rail tour from Edinburgh all the way to King's Cross would have been out of action so what would happen if Sir Eustace Missing Anderson got involved and rescued Blue Peter and the rail tour by taking the logo all the way to Darlington and then taking that same rail tour all the way to King's Cross might be a good idea and my third idea involved 257 Squadron where in the same year I believe the Channel Tunnel finally opens and I think it would be a good idea that 257 Squadron becomes the very first steam loco to be parked outside the channel tunnel but maybe have another thing involving a channel tunnel that got to do with 257 squadron but hopefully he doesn't have to go in just like that one uh, French Pacific logo actually going in and then back out. Alright, that's all three of my ideas for a Dark Railway series. Hope you enjoy. See you later, chaps. See ya!